Hello and welcome back to Siberia. This always seems to save just a little bit farther back than what um, I do and, or what I think I do and so I get a little bit of a review. So as a reminder we are in Baranor now and Kate wants to measure the radioactivity before anybody leaves and we also need to find a way to get the ostriches out of the hold. So it looks like we can interact with this. I'm not even sure what it radiation is. Radiation goggles. Oh, radiation goggles. Good. We could use the one level of, those. of ambient radiation is indicated here, but I need to be sure that the entire zone is safe. Okay. Well, let's get us some radiation goggles then. Are they going to tell us? Um, empty. It's empty. Well, okay. Uh, are the radiation goggles going to tell us how much radiation is out and about? But I guess we have to find the goggles somewhere else now. So, um, here we go. Exploring again. All about the crystal. See if we can find some radiation goggles. And then we have to move the ship forward a little bit, I suppose, in order to get the ostriches out so we can continue on our journey. This was one of the stops we were supposed to make, according to the shaman. The spirits led us here whether we wanted to come or not. And we lost the captain, by the way, fighting the lake monster, which turned out to be a real thing. Um, this is probably going to start the ship, I would think. <clears throat> oh no, we just took the key. Okay, I guess we took that just in case. We don't want it to get lost again. So when we need it, we've got it. Or we need the key for something else. Let's check through here. I'm not going to talk to you because you're not going to help me anyway, I'm pretty sure. see what there is around here. Nope. No goggles here. Oops, I didn't mean to go up there. Go back down, Kate. That is one of my biggest complaints about this game, is that the movement is so awkward. I suppose if you're using a controller, it's not. And I did try to hook up my controller, but it didn't want to work. So we're stuck with keyboard and mouse, which is okay, it's just a bit awkward. So if she kind of walks into walls and runs into things, that's why. Okay, nothing over here. This is what takes up a lot of time, is wandering around trying to find what next? Or what's going to help us? Or that one little item that we need. Like a portable Geiger counter. Here's somebody. Again, that's not going to be helpful. Let's check on our cargo. If it'll let me. Come on, let me. There we go. Well, I thought it did. It gives it to me and then it goes away. Alright. See if I can click on it during the time that it appears. Oh boy. Okay, that's just to talk to somebody. Didn't really want to do that. Mm -hmm. Workbench too high. Yeah, workbench too high. can't go up there, but I need to... there. Let me click on it. Oh my gosh. All I want to do is click on it and check the cargo. And it's just not going to let me. So maybe it's not important that I check the cargo. Okay. Fine. We won't check the cargo.
And this radiation checker must be somewhere else. I should call it a Geiger counter because that's what it really, really is. Nothing down here. Nothing there. Back upstairs. We'll check the back of the boat. I think that's the stern. I don't know. I don't know boat language. Oh, look at there's a Yuki. Captain sacrificed for Miss Kit Walk and tried. Yes, he did. He lured the sea monster away so that we could escape. Okay. I am not sure. Where I'm going to find what I need. Check up one side of the boat and down the other. Can I leave? That's Too dangerous if I no. can't detect the radiation. Okay, so it's got to be on the boat. Whatever it is I'm looking for. This side of the boat? Not seeing much. And we can't go up there. Okay, then we go back inside. What is this? Nothing. must be something in here somewhere or a way to get the goggles there has got to be something okay that's talking to people talking to people talking to people who generally have not been helpful So, the only thing I really find is this right here, <clears throat> and I don't know how to get some goggles because it's empty. And I don't know if that has to be closed in order for me to get them. I can't seem to pull on this unless it goes from a different angle. Did that to me before. Whoops. Um, yes, it does, of course. Blocked. Oh, it's blocking it. I've seen a lock like this somewhere before. Okay, is that what I needed the key for then? That's not right. Not you, the key. Blocked. Okay, how do I turn the key? Oh, there we go. Now we'll have our goggles. If I can get this to go down. There they are. And will they show me radiation? Goggles and Geiger meters at the same time. Okay, so I guess that means it all looks okay. So, can I get my key back? I guess we're not going to do any more with the ship. I have to go find the person that I need to talk to. Kirk, I guess. Where are you, Kirk? Where'd you run off to? Is 
you over here? Spirits pardon tribe and save from monster. Yes. Actually, the captain did. Miss Kate Walker must go check if bad spirits may be sneakily waiting somewhere behind you girls. <laughs> okay, Miss Kate Walker will go do that. Oh, there's Kirk right there. So these goggles let you see all of the radiation. You should go and explore the surroundings now that you can see the radiation. Okay. I will go do that then. I'm learning the weird little mechanics of this game. How to move around, how to maneuver, how to check different places that you can move up and down. Um, a few little weird things like that that are specific to this game. What is this? Oh, is that something back up here? Oh, I have to go up here to look at it. Electric outlets? Oh, okay. Not sure what I'm going to use them for, but the safest way to get her down here and onto the dock is by... Oh wait, I want to come back here a second because that was something I could look at too. No more power. Oh. Can we drag up to the outlets? No more power. Or do we need like an extension cord? Huh. Electric outlets? Okay, well apparently that's something we're going to be able to do later on. Let's talk to him about it. Not worrying, please. Me stay close. Okay. Uh-oh. How am I going to get across here? Um, this little piece right here? Oh, I have to go down. Okay. Well, let's explore down here then. Uh, certainly not in there. Okay, what about this? A paddle wheel? Oh wait, there's something to see here apparently. Oh, that's weird. Oh, it must be on the other side. Well, that was weird. What was it? must be inside. Okay, we're not going to worry about it then. Let's go check this out. I guess we can't get back up on the bridge. Oh, we have to come over here to the stairs. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's an Oscar. Oscar? <laughs> We can get us an Oscar. Oh, stupid of me. Oscar doesn't exist anymore. I know that. And all those automatons look alike. But he told you you could put the heart in him. Right? Remember that? Your medallion. Yeah. The heart, you know, it's in very good condition. It contains a lot of essential data. 
from an XZ-2000 automaton. Everything as it were. You understand, on that particular model, the heart and intelligence were intermingled. So then, it wouldn't take all that much for you to get your friend Oscar back one day. Maybe if I could... Yeah. It's a thought. Okay. So let's see if we can get our Oscar back somehow. We need a key. Locked. Okay, we know what those look like. We'll have to go find one. XZ2000, Oscar's serial number. Yeah, see, we can get Oscar back. We just need to find a key for him. Okay. What's in these buildings over here? Anything interesting? Oh, we can go up this one. Where'd my mouse go? Maybe we'll find a key in here. You never know. Something right there. A hook. Okay, I suppose we'll need that. There's a robot up there that rings the bell. Is that all that's up here apparently? All right. What about around these buildings? Anything? No? Okay. Let's go up here then. Who's this? Nobody? There's the gates. I guess we're doing okay so far. The radiation, I mean, our goggles haven't alarmed or anything. So we're pretty safe from the radiation so far. So it seems. So let's come in here. And see what we have. This looks like it's gonna be a big place. So we'll start off over here and see what's in this building and make our way around. I think we're going to have a lot of these loading screens. Okay, right away we've got something right here. That the Vorlberg cool. crest. Hans put it on all of his inventions. Yes. That would be cool if we could get it open. The Vorlberg crest. Okay. Hans but I put guess it on not. all of his inventions. I know. He did. But we can't get it open. What is this? A map of the park. I 45. 2.5. That's probably important. 15 plus 25. Well, that's 1, 2, 3. Okay. Okay. I'm sure all of that is important information that I'm going to have to come back and check out because I won't remember it, being that I really don't have a memory. Is this a closet or the way out? It looks like it might be the way out. Or a way out. Let's see what all is in here first. What is this? Oh, things to check. Are we going to have a clock in here? Something. Whoa, that was loud. Loud dogs. Something we're going to want to pick up, but I don't know what it is yet. Underneath there? I wouldn't be surprised because that's like right in the way. 
There we go. Nope. That thing. Is there something here? Here? No. Okay, all of you guys scoot away. Here? Oh, it was the cog. Okay. Was there not another cog? Okay, just one cog. We needed that, I'm sure. And I don't see... This is some kind of a construction line, isn't it? For something. And that's just the way out. I just wish there was a way to open this. The Vorlberg Crest. Hans put it on all of his inventions. Maybe I need to use one of my things on it? The knife? No way. Like Nothing. That. Let's try something else. Hmm. That. Impossible. No. Okay, so I'm going to have to find something else I can use on it to open it. Apparently. Let's go see what's out this other door and get myself completely lost. Okay. We are inside the park, outside the park. I'm, oh, are we following a rail? Oh, is this the rail that leads back to, yeah, the ship's right down there. And I've got that telescopic arm I can probably use on those things. What is this? Another Oscar? Another rundown automaton. Can I use him? None of these things. Nope. But I can use that telescopic arm for power. What's this? Oh. I should be able to tow the crystal by attaching it to this winch. Okay. But we're going to need power. Hmm. As she thinks. Is she going to pull him down? Oh. Oh. Sorry. <clears throat> and she pulled him off. No ignition controls. See, she needs him. I see. The automaton that controlled the tractor has to be connected to this pin, shaped like a Varlberg key, to start it. It's ingenious. But I need an automaton in working order. Yep. And we know where to find that. We just need to find the key. What's this? Does he have a key? <gasps> he does. A key of sorts. Let's look at that key. Okay, it's not going to say anything. It's just a small key. I wonder if it opens the box, which contains the key. Come back this way, Kate. Over here. Let's go back this way. I'm glad we turned. Oh, what's this? Something we need also? That was some fast flying. Falling. <laughs> okay, what did we get in the process? Anything? I don't know. We got it out of the way anyway. Um, so that is a beginning to at least get it out of the way. Trying to scoop my chair up without stepping on puppies. My dog had puppies and we've got them running all over the house now. Um, okay, how do I get her to go where I want her to go? 
Come on, Kate. Is this something? It looks like a bell, doesn't it? But nothing we can do to it. Oh, with it. Okay, we want to come down this way. Because we're going to see if that key fits that box. Because I have a feeling it might. Okay, where's the key? Yes. Oh, perfection. And there's the key we needed. We can get an Oscar working. Oh, and a Vorlberg wrench. What else? Vorlberg tools. Nothing better for fixing automatons. Yes, I'll say so. Vorlberg tools. Nothing better for fixing automatons. Okay, that's all she's going to say to us. So let's go out this door now. We will go fix us an Oscar. I wonder what he's going to have to say. Uh oh, who's there? Oh, well, of course. What's going Kirk, on? Kirk, what are you doing here? As you were able to explore the area without being harmed, I authorized the Yukos to go ashore. I have to show you something, Kate Walker. What is it? Is it important? Come on, Miss Kate Walker, come, okay? Okay. Cars. Barrymore, Barrymore. Below stinking rotten asphalt is sacred path of the migration. Miss Kate Ooh. Walker must hurry and quickly bring out all ostriches so you calls can take this route. What well, do you think I'm working on? I do understand that you want to respect your customs to the letter. But moving your caravan through there is suicide. That avenue is completely contaminated. No blah blah, Miss Kate Walker. It is the will of the spirits. Miss Kate Walker saw what always happens when you call the poor spirits. Uh -uh. But... Our shaman is stubborn like an old ostrich, Kate Walker. Do you think there may be another route? I don't know. For the moment, I'm concentrating on repairing an automaton to tow the crystal. As soon as I can, I'll try to find another path. Until then, please stay in the safe zones and be careful. Okay? That's telling them, Kate, because... What's that? Nothing we want to look at, apparently. Contaminated zone. Oh, okay. Um, one thing at a time. Focus on what you need to do. Now we need to find our way back out of here. See what they did to us. Oh my gosh. Okay, so how am I going to get out of here? chances are good that's exactly what I am directionally challenged I lose my way all the time I try to get a map in my head but it doesn't always work all right let's go down there come on come on gate come on we have an Oscar to fix so that we can get the ship moved don't go back up there let me tell you to do that. Over here. Oh my gosh, these stairs are going to be the death of me. Okay, we want to come over here. I 
can't get her to move. There we go. Yeah, we have an Oscar to take care of. Because we have a key now. There's the old heart. Out of order. Okay. We're going to take it out. And we are going to put in the good one. And we're going to probably use our tool. Good enough then? And now do we use the wind up key again? Huh. Okay, so there is something we need there. What would it be? the tools? Oh, that goes in there. Oh, wow. That's not easy to do because I can't see it very well. Okay, and that goes in there. Did we get it done? Oh, there we go. Now I can see it a little better. It's blocking the opening. Okay, that's what we need that for. Okay. Now we can open it. I remember these locks. They're used to activate all of Hans's inventions. I have one. Now I just have to find the right key. I thought I had the right key. I don't? Oh my gosh, I have to find another one? I thought I had found one. Okay. Now that's frustrating, because I had found one. And now I have to find another one. And it's exactly the same key. So that's not exactly thrilling me. But I guess it is what it is. We will go hunting for... What is this? What was that? Okay, let's go find a key. This was our first building, but I bet you it's not going to have another key. And it. So let's go check out some of these other.
what is this one? Well, that's just going to give us an overview of a very weird looking amusement park. I'm thinking because we saw the car to the roller coaster that somehow we're going to have to get to the roller coaster in some way. Oh look at the, the, that's a octopus thing, squid thing. But yeah, I'm thinking that roller coaster is important. And we're going to have to get there. Somehow. Okay, I was just enjoying it because it's kind of cool that it's like that. Let's head over that way. funny angle, but it says I can exit. Into what I'm hoping is, oh, but it, this is the one that's all blocked. The park must be behind there. Okay. And you didn't have a key. We saw it come up somewhere. Was it over here? Oh, you know where I bet it was. Remember when we went through the building, it looked like tracks and there was a car there? Do you think it was over there? That must be the other way to get into the park because there was also a broken gate there. The fence was broken. And I think I'm going to look at that map and take a picture of it on my phone because I'm pretty sure that is going to become important. Well, there's some more tools Nothing up there. Nothing that looks anything like an activation key. No. And there wasn't another one in here, was there? Just the Vorlberg tools. Nothing better for fixing automatons. Yeah, and there's all kinds of keys here, but none of them are going to work. Just as I thought. No activation key. <sighs> okay. Well, I want to get a picture of this because I think it's got some important information on it for us. So I'm going to get a picture of it. So that we've got that information. Okay. And let's go over to this other door and leave. Somebody sleeping here. He's so, so close to the edge, he's gonna fall off. But look, we can get into the park from here. Okay. Oh, come on. Go where I'm telling you to go. Can we get in this door? No. Can we get in through here? No.
I bet that's the reason it was pushing me around the other way. Because we can't go through here either. So we have to go around this way. Come here. Can we go up that? We can. Climbing the Ladder of Success. I had to get a drink there. This must be where we use our gear. So come on up, Kate. Come over here. And let's pull out our Something's gear. Something's wrong. Does that help? There we go, we got that going. Okay, let's go look at this over here now. Unless we still think something's wrong there, but it doesn't look like there's anything more we can do. Okay. Let's come over here, because there was a button. Without electricity, I won't be able to do anything. Right. Okay, so this is no good. Somehow he moved the car, but apparently nobody else can. So we still have to find the key that we need. Somewhere. Some. Somehow, I won't sing. That won't be pretty. We can't go up there. Can we go up this? No. This roller coaster runs all through here. And we explored all of this and didn't get anywhere. If we go back to the old automaton, I thought we pretty much stripped him dry, but... Or if we can find that blacksmith who's supposed to set things up as soon as they land, so you can make things. Oh look, they made a bridge going across. And we've got our stretcher thingamajiggers now. So maybe we can plug this into the ship. All right. Those things. Oops, we have to get over there first. Okay. No? No more power. Okay, come on. Let's look at our stretch of thing checkers then. Observe. Do we need to stretch it out? It says it's telescopic. There we go. There. Now we can use a, our telescopic hook when we get a better view up here okay miss catwalk need some help of course i do yes please yes can you connect this cable to the crystal Maybe that way I'll be able to restore power to the park. No problem. Okay. Thank Yay. you so much for your help, Mr. Baruth.
Electric outlets. Okay. Well, can we do it? No, we'll go back to them. Kate. Don't give me a hard time. Go light boat again. Use time to connect strange magic rope. Okay. Go light boat. Does that mean turn it on? All right, let's see now. This way. This park is very confusing, isn't it? Radiation everywhere around the park. Better be careful. What's over here? Okay. That was one of the things we needed. Yes, I did look at a little guide because I was getting frustrated. I didn't know what else to do. I didn't understand light. The ship. But I did remember that we saw that little car pull up somewhere. And that there should be a way to get up to it. Come on, Kate. No, we can't go up the stairs. Yes, we can. Okay. And what is this? Is that a copy of the map? I'm sure it's in our journal. Observe. One, two, three. Okay. Just a crumpled up note. All right. What else? What is this? Somebody really went all out. Okay. And then there's this. Oh, we're going to get in it. Are we going to go for a ride? Yes, we are. And we're going to use this. Now, remember on our map that we saw, I was looking for my phone, where I took the picture of the map. There was a 15 plus 25. Those numbers are important. We are going to go back over here and look at this and we are going to put inventory. One of these in 15 and one in 25. Crank it up. Maybe we have to lift that first. Oh, because it's hitting that thing. Um, maybe we need to crank it up first. 
and then put those in. Because we want to make sure we have enough power. There we go. And now we will put a rod in 15 and a rod in 25 and we will once I get the okay let it go Okay, so we're going to stop here. We'll take that out. I don't know why we needed 25 there to stop there, but... There we go. And we can get out here. And immediately go down here. Okay, what have we got over here? Let's see. A couple of guys. I lifted up my goggles, so I must feel pretty safe. Bunch of rubble. The park yeah. must be behind there. So that wasn't very helpful. There's something else around here I need. the steps we don't see much of anything except the rubble. Back down the steps, can we go through here? Oh, we can come this way. What's over here? Is that where we came from? Thinking it is. Yeah. So we don't want to go through there. Let's come this way. Oh, look at this. What's that? A map. I guess the red line is the way we want to come. Oh, that was another one. So they're both cinematics. What's in here? A photo album. My Andre. Okay. I wanted to look at this because... I don't know. What's over here? 
A real yeah. girly girl's room. Is my key along here? Okay, soap opera radio. Not finding a whole lot. It says I can look at that, but there's nothing I can do with it. Oh, can we use that? That's not right. Can we use that? Nothing. Can we use that? It doesn't Nothing work. Works. Okay. So I probably have to get something, a key, something like that. Huh? Uh -oh. Who are you? And what on earth are you doing here? What's oh, your name? uh, hi. Excuse me. So you're the tramp that decided to use my cart? I had to go all the way up the track with the game I caught uh -oh. on my back because of you. Pardon me. I'm so sorry, ma'am. I'm accompanying this tribe, and we're trying to leave the park. I thought that that old cart was abandoned and that I could use it. I never thought I'd do any harm. Hmm. Should have looked around a bit first, though. It ain't abandoned for everybody. Oh, that's a cute little automaton dog. Huh. Don't that beat all. There you are, you good boy. Mama'll have you up and running in no time. She does have the key that we need. What's this key for? For activating the park automatons. You need to give them a good turn of the key every so often, or the poor things get all neurasthenic. Even cantankerous. <laughs> Plus they break down. There. Let's introduce ourselves first before we make demands. Listen, I didn't really want to get off on the wrong foot with you. Let me introduce myself. I'm Kate Walker. I'm accompanying the Yukul tribe on their migration to their sacred lands. And you're... Oh, an American. Yeah, yeah, I'd bet anything. Well, well, look at that. An American. <laughs> well, I'm Staff Sergeant Katerina Viktorovna Drostolova. Gold medalist in the shot put in the Moscow Olympics. And the widow of Lieutenant Andrei Grigorovich Drostolov, veteran artillery officer and figure skating champion. Hmm. Delighted to meet you, Katerina. It seems you might be just the person I'm looking for. Do you think you could let me borrow that strange key of yours? I needed to repair an automaton without whom, I'm afraid, it is impossible for us to leave. You've been really polite and you speak the same way they talk in those books, little lady. You do have a bit of backbone, I'll say that much for you. This key is extremely precious to me. As far as I know, your gang of gnomes and you might just be one of those gangs of bandits that hang around here. Scrap dealers looking in every nook and cranny for a pot of gold, despite the radiation around here. I saw those riffraff off with a load of buckshot. Oh, we're not that. Um... Do I want to lie or do I want to insist? Hey, I'm talking to you. If I really were a raider, I'd go for your freight car here. It's charming. Everything here is so <laughs> precious and in such good taste. How long have you been living a here? Bunny lap. Oh, it's been almost 40 years now. My Andre and me worked on the park maintenance. Actually, the bunny lamp is kind of After cute. the Olympics came to an end. Just goes to show. 40? I thought all the survivors left after the catastrophe. 
We tried, but the ferry for Valsenbor went and left without us. We managed to take shelter hiding down in the subway system after Andre found a way in with the cart. My Andreu's show was always very, very organized. He realized that the cave-in at the entrance would probably keep the air pure. But it was already too late for him, unfortunately. Your husband was contaminated? Both of us did, actually. But it didn't do anything to me. That's just the way I was made. Or maybe I was immune because of all the garbage they kept giving me for years so that I could win that trinket at the Olympics. And since then, you've never tried to get to Valsenbor? No. I heard that all of the irradiated survivors were sent to this clinic there and they never get out. Besides, I have absolutely everything I need here. Somewhere to call home. I'm near my dear Andreusha. I have my dog and all the game I want. Well, why don't you and your band of savages stock up while you're waiting? Even runs have to eat sometimes, I figure. We don't have much time left. We're being chased. And without your key, we're done for. <laughs> fine, fine. Here you go. Yay, but you take good care key. of it, okay? We get to I make promise, an Oscar. Katerina. One last thing before I go. You said the air in the subway stayed pure. Does it lead out of the city? Yes. Just follow the tracks right behind my place and you can get out to the other side of Baranor through the Olympia Stadium station at the end of the line. That's the terminus. Not only do you avoid the radiation, but you also have electricity. It's one of the only circuits in the city that's still working. You just have to be careful. Some of the pipes gave way and flooded some galleries with lake water. So that's the way I suppose Thank we'll you, Katarina, be going. Thank you, Katarina, for everything. Okay. So we can go put our key in Oscar and we will do that in the next video. Thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying. If you are, give me a like, make a few comments, maybe how I can do better or what you would like to see. And think about subscribing also because I play lots of different games here on this channel. And I will see you back in Siberia. Bye bye for now.